What were the best and worst aspects of immersing yourself in the life and times of Lorraine Hansberry? Oh gosh, I guess the, the best aspects were um, being in the archive and reading you know, her letters and diaries, but also all of this work that she did that I had no idea about. So poems and little vignettes and stories and even novels, it's just, just um, it's, it's a beautiful, rich, um, complex body of work, and so it's just really a joy to have access to something that people haven't yet had access to. And, and I guess that that's also the worst part, is that it's difficult um, when you're trying to tell a story about someone's life to figure out what to tell and what not to tell. And, and you, there's so much that you have to leave out in order to create the, an arc. Um, and to tell a coherent story so that that um, point of making decisions about what to include or exclude, that's, that's hard.